Hey everyone, welcome. I'm Dan Caglione. This is Preg Appetit and welcome to our kitchen. We're joined by Renata today. Hi everybody, I'm Renata Filiacci. I'm a holistic practitioner and I'm also training to become a certified doula. And today we have an Italian pie that's nutritious, delicious, and ready for you. Definitely, this recipe is full of tons of nutrients. One of the biggest ones is folate, which is really good for a healthy development of a baby. Yeah, so. perfect. Yeah, it's got vitamin K, vitamin C. Fiber is a really big one too for, for digestion. Sure. So yeah. that's excellent to have when you are carrying. And fiber also gets <laughs> things moving too, right? So yeah. it does, yeah. I mean, that's, you know, but that's something that happens when, yeah. when a woman is pregnant. Not that I know from experience, because it's never happened to me, but uh, <laughs> yeah. So why don't we get started? I just, I love the smell of the basil. Me too. It's like, you know, being Italian, and I know obviously you're Italian as well. Yeah. It's like, it's like almost like cologne for us. You know, we put it on. Yeah, I feel like we really... also reek of garlic too. What do you mean? <laughs> like, <laughs> it's the bugs away, right? And the people you don't like, so it's fine. Right. So we just finished dicing yeah. our tomatoes and chopping our basil. So now we're gonna take all of our ingredients, the spinach, onions, garlic, mushrooms and beans and saute them in the pan. So mushrooms are real quick. Mushrooms are interesting to me because I didn't know it was safe for pregnancy. So. Yeah, so mushrooms are a superfood. So their DNA resembles ours, which is awesome. And they're also very high in a polysaccharide, which is a great carbohydrate that is an anti-inflammatory. I just don't suggest eating them raw, okay. but once they're cooked, perfect for pregnant women. Great, so now that we've sauteed all of our ingredients that are gonna go inside, we're gonna begin to assemble it using our crescent rolls. Yes, yeah, so this is a really easy part too. Um, and so you just begin by spraying your pan. So give it a good spray. So the crescent rolls do not stick. You just lay down your crescent rolls on the bottom. And then you would add your filling. And the really cool thing about crescent rolls is when you have them just laying around after the holidays, you can make a really awesome Absolutely. Italian pie. So that's the cool thing about it. Fun fact about the crescent rolls, they're actually full of fiber. Yeah, so crescent rolls are high in fiber, so once again, great for your digestion. So now he's going to put the filling in and just put all it all in. in. All dump in, in. yeah. Right, let's just dump it all in. Dump it all in. Let me just smear it around. Yep. Nice, okay. And then we top with Parmesan cheese. And Parmesan cheese is really good too because it's high in calcium, vitamin D, and B vitamins. So once again, great for the development and also bones. So now we just bake it uh, 10 to 12 minutes at 425 and or until the top is golden brown. Easy enough, let's go. We're gonna dig in. I'm excited. Go ahead. And it does smell really good in there. Oh my God. Delicious. Everything is perfectly balanced. That crescent roll with everything mixed in is, and the mushrooms are just like unbelievable. For this recipe and other delicious, nutritious recipes, make sure you visit pregappetit.com. And while you're there, book your 30 minute free consultation call. Can't wait to see you there.